Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Our last break of the night is gonna be our last break of Sapphire. I think we are, we, Nick said we are getting one more case. I'm not sure when that's gonna be posted, but keep an eye on jazbeescasebreaks.com for that. Big thanks to all of these folks digging deep. I know some of the big teams with the big rookie names are kind of expensive, but I appreciate everyone. Hey, scared money don't make money. I appreciate everyone not being scared. Like Marco and the Mets. Last spot mojo, Metropolitans. And there you go. And these are the last five boxes right here. So I'm going to open up all the boxes at once. everybody boombox what's going on we're talking we're talking a little Dodgers ownership history recently we're talking about how $20 parking was an issue out here but you're saying $20 is cheap yeah you probably boombox is saying and I was saying how Frank McCord had $20 parking bad product on the field People were staying away from the stadium, and then Magic Johnson, new ownership, Stan Kasten, dropped it to 10 to make it, uh, to get kind of fans back in their good graces. But um, it's as high as 50 bucks at T Mobile for the Mariners, but how many parking spots do you have? I'll bet we have three times more parking spots than, than T Mobile for the Mariners. I know parking's outrageous at, um, what do they call it now? The Giant Stadium, Candlestick. I'm just going to keep calling it Candlestick. Uh, it's been like AT&T, Oracle, O, 3Com. Where the Giants play, I know parking's kind of crazy there too because there's no, I mean, remember Dodger Stadium is on like a big hill. There's a little stadium right there and a big hill and it's just a sea of parking, parking spaces. <laughs> Break eight coming at you. There's pack one, two, three, four, and five. Good luck. Figure team eight. I think we are getting another. They, I think these come in loose boxes, so they don't come in those traditional cases. Our distributor just put 40 boxes inside a big cardboard box and, and send it to us so all right and Rory needs a Keston in here too Keston Hira the pride of UC Irvine Rory the pride of Valencia California where he is from the pride of UC Irvine where he played college oh it doesn't show the parking lot here bring it in Five out of five. Uh-oh. Stat leaders hug it out in the postseason. That's a randomizer to one person in the break. There you go. Everyone has a shot at this train whistle at the very end. We'll set that aside over there. Don Rab says he parks at the parking lot that was featuring Jack Reacher. I, I know that parking lot. There was a sniper up there. And that's about 20 or 30 bucks, depending on when you reserve. Oh, you can reserve it? That's a stadium I want to go to, PNC. That looks like a beautiful place to see uh, a beautiful place to see a game. 
Ray Black. Giants, Michael Dubois. There it is, Rory. Keston Hira. Rookie Keston Hira. There it is, your guy, Rory. The pride of Valencia, California. And a UC Irvine anteater. What does this go for on the secondary market, Rory? Justin Turner. There's you, Darvish. 21 out of 25. Sorry, Cubs. Josh Exline with the Cubbies. You, Darvish, starting to look pretty good the second half of the season. Still a lot of money for Darvish, I think. All right. Next one. 65 to 80 on that testing. Yeah, I don't think there's a team affiliation. It just says National League on there, but I'll randomize it to the entire group. Maybe grade it, Rory. What does it mean? I feel like I feel like this stuff would be great candidates for grading. And with a good grade could improve the value significantly. All right. You will grade it. Should it be now we're gonna randomize it to the group. Should just be the NL I suppose technically yes, but maybe next time. We'll put that in the item description. I didn't realize that was gonna be a thing. There's Ronnie Rodriguez autograph. Detroit Tigers. That'll be for Michael Dubois. Well, let me know what it grades out at, Rory. It's another park I want. Another ballpark I want to go to. That looks pretty cool, too. And look at that. Otani gets hot right there with the Japanese characters in there too. David Sitko with the Halos. Nice orange Otani, 9 out of 25. And there's Syndergaard there, too. All right. What does the back of the what of this card? I don't know, just a checklist. The White Sox game isn't anything special. Stick to Wrigley. I've been to Wrigley. It's pretty nice. I was... I knew it friendly confined. I knew it was small, right? I, I guess I just... And I, I went there recently, too. Maybe four years ago or something like that. Three, four years ago. And I was... Still surprised. I knew it was small. I was still surprised at how tiny it was. I'm used to Dodger Stadium. 56,000 people can squeeze into that stadium. There's a massive parking lot. You know, it's still tiny right here. There's a massive parking lot around there where everyone can park and walk up to the ballpark and everything. And we took an Uber down there. This is when we were at the National with Jaspies. And, and I was just like, well, so where is it? And I have a lot of friends from Chicago, and they're like, it's beautiful. You just turn a corner, and all of a sudden, it's the ball. And that's exactly how it happened. We went down the street. We turned a corner. All of a sudden, there was the, there was the ballpark. And it was, it was great. It was extremely – it was very charming, I have to say. There's Dal Lugo, another Tiger for Michael. But the Chicago White Sox team is nothing special. There's a shower there, Brian. There's a shower in the concourse. What about that, man? 
I just like ballparks. I just want to see a ballpark. Yeah, I need to go to Miller Park. I'd like to see that. Go down the slide. Definitely want to go here to PNC. And we've got Eduardo Nunez. Oh, I don't want that highlight. 7 out of 25 for the Red Sox. Did I pass a Juan Soto? Sorry if I did. Uh, Red Sox Elvis Ekman. We'll, we'll dig that out. Oh, there it is. No, oh, because it was, it was horizontal. I'll blame it on that. There you go. Sean Mandel with the Nationals. EA saying that Soto, this Soto right here, goes for about 50, 60 bucks. Pretty nice. All right. Next box. Did I miss a Kyle Tucker rookie? There you go, shows. Darren McKenzie. All right. Next box. I know. I'm running out, definitely running out of steam. Corey Kluber got. Did he get re signed? I thought that was interesting. Are we saving Josh James? Might as well at this point. What an embarrassment of riches for the Astros. God, what a farm system for them. There's Ryan Brazier. 10 out of 10. Purple for the Bo Sox. That's going to go to Elvis Ekman. The Ek. We've got... What else do we have here? Reese McGuire, rookie auto for the Blue Jays. A.J. Anderson, who doesn't even collect baseball and said he just wanted to help out the crew, snag the Blue Jays. Thanks, man. Ozzy Albies. There's Progressive Field. Or the Jake. I want to go here too. Camden Yards. Roy's predicting a super in the last box. That'd be a nice way to end it. Then we got that too to randomize. And the money, the break credit. All right, last one. Good luck, everybody. This is Pick Your Team 8. I think Nick did say we were going to get another uh, case of this. I don't know when that's coming in, when we're loading it all up. Oh, it's up. Rory, go get it. Everybody, breaks 9 through 16 are up. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. All teams are in. Oh, someone got a team in break 9. So there's 29 left. So for you Night Owls, stayed up late with us, that's your reward. You get the first crack at the next round, the next uh, 40 box case that we're going to get of Sapphire.
Brock Peterson with a home run tonight. And there's Josh Harrison for the Pirates. That'll be for Michael. Six out of ten. And wow, Austin Riley red. Darren McKenzie, not quite the super fracture that Rory was predicting, but a three out of five Austin Riley red autograph. Wow. That's pretty crazy right there. Darren, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Francisco Mejia and Sal Perez at the end. All cards shipping this stuff too, so go and get it. Go get the next round on jazpiececasebreaks.com. All right. So let's go back to the list. We're going to run two different randomizers. The first one, I'm going to grab all the names. The first one will be for... Uh, the out of five stats leader card. So everyone has a shot at that. The second randomizer will be for the break credit. If you bought at least two teams, you get one entry for $50 of break credit. Four teams gets you two. Six teams gets you three, so on and so forth. Darren, you have two. That's one. Sitko, you have two. That's one. Elvis Ekman, you got three teams, but only two count. You get one. EA gets an entry. The X line... Who is, gets four eight gets four entries? Michael, you got four. You get two entries. And Steve Locke, you got two teams. You get one entry. So one spot out of eleven is going to get a shot at fifty dollars of break credit. All right, let's roll it and randomize it. Both lists eight times, two and a six. One, two, three, this is for the card, five, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. After eight, name on top is going to be Michael Dubois. There you go, Michael. Bring it in, Mike. Five out of five. Michael, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. And let's give away the money as well. Two and a six, eight times for this small list right here. Name on top, 50 bucks of break credit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And good luck, everybody. Eight times Elvis Ekman. All right, there you go. Elvis is in the building. $50 of break credit going your way. Thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you next time at jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you tomorrow. Friday, Friday? Tomorrow's Friday. Friday, 2 o'clock Pacific, 5 o'clock Eastern. Seven nights a week, 2 o'clock Pacific, 5 o'clock Eastern. That's when we start. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. We'll see you next time.